Hey ladies, so you know when you're out with your girlfriends, it's 2 a.m., you've sweated off most of your makeup, you meet a really cute guy, and you think, hmm, let me make sure I don't look a hot mess. So you run to the bathroom. Now, usually you just have a couple things in your clutch, so I'm going to tell you what you really need to have and how to apply it. Drugstore makeup is awesome. Besides the fact that it's cheap, it's also um, multifunctional and it's just as great quality as anything you'll find at a Sephora or an Ulta store. So the three things I have are a lip and cheek stain, a lip gloss, mascara. Now the first thing you wanna do when you look in the mirror is take a look at the lipstick. If it's on your teeth or if it's smudging or if the color is just fading away, grab a paper towel and wipe it all off. And of course, replace with your gloss. I am using the Lustrous Lip Polish from Circa Makeup. The great thing about gloss is the shininess sort of pumps up the volume, it looks really glam, and it's not messy. All right, the second thing is a lip and cheek stain. What I love about lip and cheek stains is that one, it's multifunctional. And the great thing about this one in particular is that it dries fast, and when you're on a time crunch and you're out somewhere, that actually helps because it sort of pressures you to like, get going and put it on. All you want to do is take it, it comes equipped with the brush applicator, which is awesome. Apply to the apples of your cheeks and blend with your finger. It just brings a lot of life and color back to the face when you've been like dancing all night or you've been out in the hot weather. And if the gloss isn't enough, you can also apply it to your lips as well. Lastly, I would always choose mascara over eyeliner because eyeliner smudges, but mascara, it's super easy to tuck in your purse and the chances of it clumping are small. Okay, and that is about it. Remember when you're freshening up your makeup on the go to always carry your lip gloss, mascara, and cheek stain. And that wraps it up for this week. Be sure to subscribe, leave me comments, and tune in next week for Makeup Monday.